Theorem 4 of Invertible Matrix In this module you will learn about Theorem 4 of an Invertible Matrix. Theorem If A and B are two invertible matrices of the same order, then AB whole inverse equals the product of B inverse and A inverse. Let us now prove this statement. Let A and B be two invertible squared matrices of order M. Using the definition of inverse of matrix, we get product of AB within brackets and AB whole inverse equals I. Free multiplying both sides by A inverse, we get product of A inverse AB within brackets and AB whole inverse equals product of A inverse I. Using associative law, this results in product of A inverse A, B and AB whole inverse equals A inverse. Using the result A inverse A equals I, we get product of B and AB whole inverse equals A inverse. Free multiplying both sides by B inverse, we get product of B inverse, B and AB whole inverse equals product of B inverse and A inverse. Using the result B inverse B equals I, we get AB whole inverse equals product of B inverse and A inverse. Let A be a matrix with elements 2, 3, 1 and minus 4. B be a matrix with elements 1, minus 2, minus 1 and 3. We also define inverse of these matrices as A inverse as a matrix with minus 1 by 11 as scalar multiple and minus 4, minus 3, minus 1 and 2 within brackets. B inverse as a matrix with elements 3, 2, 1 and 1. The product of B inverse and A inverse is given by product of scalar 1 by 11 and elements 14, 5, 5 and 1. This is statement 1. Product of AB is a matrix with elements minus 1, 5, 5 and minus 14. We also define Inverse of AB is given by product of scalar 1 by 11 and elements 14, 5, 5 and 1. This is statement 2. From 1 and 2 we get AB whole inverse equals product of B inverse and A inverse. In this module you have learnt about theorem 4 of an invertible matrix which states that if A and B are two invertible matrices of the same order, then AB whole inverse equals the product of B inverse and A inverse.